Uh, I'm about to reveal deck. Uh, here's the Letho. Um, Spy reveal deck. Let's go. Any card that needs to be revealed. Uh. Nithril over this, I think. Monster's Nest just kind of sucks. Any spy as well. It's pretty okay. We don't have fog, so can't go fog look. I don't want to play this bronze special, honestly. Alright, so I just need... If only we didn't take these meme cards, man. This was a... This, w this is a draft, alright. Okay, 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 wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Uh, runestone? Yeah, sure. These aren't clan units, so... Uh, bl blue dream. You can blue dream Letho, yeah. Ah, oh, spy! <laughs> Letho the Letho! Shiller, the no, blue dream. Blue dream. Uh, that's another demune unit, but, yeah. I mean, this, this, that's a combo. How have we not found any reveal synergy? Please. I need one special. I guess it's Peasant Militia. Because the others suck real bad. Um, yeah, I guess Yennefer. I'm not playing these cards. This is, yeah, I don't have organics. None of these are the organics. Oh shit, can you guys hear that? Oh yeah, you could hear that. What's point of Letho? Oh well we oh look, we can we can kill it because it's a spy, right? It's just double lock, dude. It's so good. Wait, actually Siri. <gasps> and we take the Bruver, right? Uh, what silvers do we have that we can play? This, this, uh, then it's two silvers, four silvers we don't want to play. But is there a dwarf we can play? No, actually Bruver is really bad. Bruver has exactly two targets. But that might still be better than, than Eredin. Because it's thinning. And we can always play like Nithril early. And death mold. Yeah, okay, Bruver's still probably better. Though it's a bit harder to get him to trigger. Open Aram, you lazy bastards. You'll sleep when you're dead. Versus Herald first. Okay. Regis Letho combo exists. Toss that first. Toss this second, because I need to like actually in you know, oh mm. Yeah, this deck might have some consistency issues. Just just saying. Cause uh Reinfarn has exactly one target. Regis is only good with Letho, and Letho is only good with Regis. But we've got double blue dream to to, to play Le Letho again, right? Easy. Or to blue dream Regis. <laughs> we don't really have carryover. Um but we got the duels. For the Emperor. I think we just play this and just kind of reveal some cards. Okay, so he's got to heal. Oh, is this Wild Hunt? Yeah, it is Wild Hunt. So Nithril actually is a 7, uh, 13. That's pretty good. 
It's pretty okay. That's an early for him. That's, that's a pretty big unit you got there. I mean, I could play this as a 21, but, but I could also not. I'm going to play this now because otherwise it could brick. I really don't want it to brick. He doesn't... He hasn't played any carryover, so it's fine, right? What's gonna happen? It's the worst that can happen. Right? I picked up the peasant militia just to make sure that the... Oh, my... Fuck, how do we... Okay, so I guess we can... I guess we can bleed them out here. So we could play trebuchet here if we get slightly lucky. Thing is, I want to play a gold card just so I can. Um, oh, does this trigger? Oh, I should have played this on the left side. Actually, I should have played Slave Driver on the right so I could play this in the middle. Because now I want to play it on the right side. This is fine, I guess. Because that's an 8. This kills an 8. Oh, and it's a roach on the correct row. That's pretty good. Yeah, because if this is on the left, this triggers before this. And then next turn we can toss this away and we're really happy. Like yeah, we didn't we didn't get the Vrahid Neophyte buff on this, but that's fine, right? Neophyte. Whatever you wanna call it. Okay. Okay. I was hoping this would, you know. Oh my god, missed two 50 50s feels bad, man. I, I assumed he didn't realize he can't damage here, because this has four units, so he could only damage this. I'm assuming that's what happened. You know? A Noxenford scholar once examined a panther and declared it was nothing more than a leopard of a different color. The panther seemed indifferent to this pronouncement and gobbled him up before he could complete his research. How, how unfortunate. Now we will see who is weak. Nice. Hit the good target, kind of. The North, he waited quite a while to play that. He he sure waited a long time. So he still needs to play 27. Mm, that's uh, that's not gonna be good enough, unless he plays a really good card. That's it's a good card, but it's not that good of a card. It's, a, it's quite a good card, though. I do admit. So the best thing that's gonna happen is we're gonna draw um, Letho of Gullet and Salt Kirk, and then. We're gonna Reinfarn Joachim into Nausicaa Brigade. Hello, Mongoose. What up, my dude? Ah, okay, that's a runestone. At least it's not bad. So this is just a 15 most likely, unless he's got a bronze special in his deck that's better than 9. So I'll wait a bit before I play this, because I don't necessarily want to play Peasant Militia. Mandrake's already better, right? Mandrake's 8 plus 3, so it's an 11. 
He's gonna no. That's disgusting. Well then. Let's that that's actually disgusting to be honest. Um, that, that was actually quite scary. But that's okay. Do I have a way of killing that? Wait. This is too big. I need this to be smaller. Is there a way we can do that? Because, like, we can blue dream the Sabbath. But it's a 7, so this is too big. If he's... Wait. We can do this. While this might not be that amazing, as it's only, you know, it's only, what, 18 points? Um, 19 points. Plus the one that was carry over. So this is 20. We can blue dream uh, Imeldred here and kill this Aukvist. Unless he plays a 10, in which case it's going to kill the 10, which is still fine. And then it can kill this the following turn, hopefully. I should have played this front row, but it's fine. I shall relieve them of all it's an 11. I need to, like, find a way to deal damage. This has a way of dealing damage, I guess. We have... oh boy. Wait. Wait a second. That's that's solid. It's really good actually. That's that's even better than doing damage. Oh no. It's quite solid, honestly. It's got 8 points here. Which, uh, yeah, isn't good enough. So that's quite good. We got the combo. We can toss this. That's pretty good. Toss this as well. Okay, nice. So I don't really want to play this round, and there's no reason for me to really play this round other than the fact that I could draw Nithril and Roach, and Fahim, and Reinfarn. But I can draw all of them, so it's fine. Can I up the IQ gain for subs? I could use it, please. Oh yeah, also, continue. I hope you have your continued enjoyment of an additional 50 IQ. Um, I don't think I can. It More than 50 IQ is a bit out of my league right now i'm not i'm not uh you know partnered yet maybe once partnership hits and we hit you know five or ten emotes or something along those lines then maybe we'll be able to up it like slowly maybe up to 60 and then maybe once you know again we hit like 10 emotes maybe up to 70 etc etc you know there is one of those things in your bed there is nothing in my bed. No retreat, not one step. Yes. I guess he's got a way to res, but that's still an eleven when resed once, so he has to have two reses. Nice, if this hits these two, it's quite strong. Uh, so let me just tempo him here. Because we do want a tempo here. Uh, well, while we can kill this, we can also kill that with this. So I guess we'll just kill that with this. That That's a lot of tempo used. I kind of need to save some of these cards to enable Blue Dream. I didn't want to use Death Mold yet because it's my only weather clear. That's a bit scary. Fight for the Emperor and you might be free. Uh, hmm. 
Don't have any curse units, so this is a 9. This is also a 9. This is a 8. Now it's better. I'd assume this would trigger as soon as I went into create, so I was assuming it was the reveal, that's why I didn't pick up. Um, or it wasn't Moran, I should say. I strive above all to be just. It's quite solid. Um, I think we just play a bad card. We play some peasants. They, these are actually chat cosplayers. Twitch chat cosplay right here. Okay, we can play this. Uh, again, we don't really have any... I guess we can just play this, yeah. Locke has one point of carryover. Calm yourselves. I guess this is where we now play this boy. Didn't go on Saltkirk or on Triss. But that, that's okay, I guess. Ooh. Use the Kinesis here. We could also use the Letho Regis combo right now. But I really want to save that. I'll play this card for now. It's a Django. We don't really have. Actually, no. This is fine. Haven't got all day. So the big thing is, if he ends up eating this, he's giving us points because of Letho Regis. As long as he doesn't bleed us out of Letho Regis, you know. No. That's that's unfortunate. But that's also my uh, my blue dream, which is more fortunate. I guess we can thin the deck at that bit. Very likely for him to pass sometime soon. I kind of want to play Lethory just now before I can't play it anymore. Yet to speak its last. Hmm. He went Reconnaissance, yeah? Most likely. Oh, Treason. Oh, I can't play Letho then. Your will be done, sire. I guess we can just get, kill Coral, and if he continues, we can... We can blue dream coral. He really should be passing soon. Can, can I just get my Letho Regis combo off next round, please? That's all I ask. Uh, I suppose. But I won't have any proactive plays. Siri really helps in these type of situations. Because you play Siri and then like... I mean, you, I guess you gotta win round one. Winning round one is so much better than getting bled out completely. Oh, there's the pass. Okay, so first of all, we we have Salt Kirk, which will kill something. Then we've got... I, I don't know, dude. I, I guess we keep this, but I could toss it as well. That That's even worse. Okay, that's fine. Wait, I should have kept that. I should have kept because it's a lasso target. Is is he even gonna play anything that's big enough to lasso? Come on, play a. Uh, hmm. That's... Yeah, it's a target. 
We can we can kill that easy. That's a nice, nice, nice. We did it. We got it. We got the. Oh, he got really unlucky not drawing this. Eh? I mean, drawing this. Into game we go. So we toss that. We. I want to toss this card as well. I guess we're not using what. Mm, actually, we could use that round one, and then we can toss this round two. If he like plays a card, we can just do this to tempo him out. I think that's fair. If he plays round one. Solid. Yeah, we can definitely just tempo him here. Hey, that that works. I'm, I'm looking for death mold here. Or I'm not looking for death mold here because death mold is my only other Bruver target. Bruver is really weak in this deck. That's enough beasts, I guess. So do we want to clear fog? No, we want to do rain, I think. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure doing rain is better. Because we're. this is a four point difference, right? This is only getting rid of two. So we can go up to cards now. That's quite good. I'll take it. That's unfortunate, but honestly, it's just like, oh, okay, I guess I'll play a six point play to win this round, to win this round, right? So it's quite okay. Not, not the worst thing in the world. We've got some bad cards in hand, but we do have the Lethal Regis combo and we've got a Blue Dream. So as long as we don't draw, as long as we don't draw... Roach, we're fine. But the air's not amazing. I think we toss this card and just hope to not draw Roach. Lovely. Lovely. Absolutely amazingly lovely. So I'm just going to uh, reveal these two cards because they don't really tell anything about my deck. And this is completely fair. Now just looking to... Ooh, he also has that. Winch, you say? That's not that great of a card. Um, hmm. Killing that would be useful. I guess we can just play Fog here. I know he's got Ida, but this is fair. If he uses Ida to weather clear, I think that's okay. He's, he's got another... Okay. It's kind of, kind of annoying, but it's, it's fine. Just play another woodland and that's okay. Sure. He's gonna shiny it. Yeah, I remember now. He has another one of those. So we just looking for Ida here, I think. I think we're just looking for Ida here. We can play Ornamental Sword. Or play... Uh, that's Ornamental Sword is fine. Might be able to kill that? No. I don't think Peasant Militia is a... No, it's a tactic. This is worthless as well. This just deals 4 damage. I guess is okay. Let us put our steel to the we should have done 2 damage to this, honestly. 4 damage to this, because then we could have found something to deal damage as well. It's fine. We're just gonna play the these boys here for now. Should I salt Kirk this? I don't know. It's like it's wasting a potential of about five damage. It does prevent six damage, I guess. So it's still okay. I should have done this round one, honestly. Turn one should have just killed it immediately. It's quite weak.
Stand and fight, cowards. The thing is, these two things will buff themselves super high, which means my Letho Regis is actually going to be quite strong. And we're 25 points ahead. So while one of these will most likely die to Ida, this is fine. Okay, that's again not not amazing, honestly. Thank you. Fog doesn't do enough, so he has to actually thunder here. Thunders for seven instead of for nine, so this is already technically an eleven. And now we can just buy another one. Hi. I'm on it. That's fair, but again, hits three armor. Fight for the Emperor and you might be freed. Could mulligan away that card. I think I'll take it. This is a 15 point play, so Blood it's quite and strong. Hands. And while this is a 12, we probably get something that's almost enough. Almost good enough. The other player was playing a 10, and this is a 9. That's a bit unfortunate, but I think it's okay. Good, didn't hit one of these two cards, so that's quite good for me. That's a that's a pretty big salt key, Kirk. I'm coming for you. I hope we can trust you. If only he had locked that. Anything in particular interest you? <laughs> So good. I toss this first, of course. I kind of want to toss this because it's just kind of bad. And I want to toss this just because, uh, yeah, potential cards we can draw. I guess we can pass. We've got the combo yet again. It's just the blue dream that we have to activate, but we've got uh, we've got salt Kirk, so it can kill any gold. Can we not draw Roach every single time? I guess we can sometimes find discard cards, so this is better than like Peasant Militia. I would have loved some other golds here. Okay, do we toss this? A roach is really bad, and we mulliganed it away, so very likely to see it. Nice. We can open with this, really good. This this has an option of hitting Saltkirk later on, so that's completely fine. Can't believe he used Bran as his weakest card. I guess it is only a 12. But it's removal. It's a bit more... A bit stronger, I should say. Annoying. Oh my. No, that's actually quite good. Uh, maybe I should have put these two together so he can't. With my shield or on it. The one damage doesn't really matter, but oh my god. Could play this on the left side as well. Yeah, I should have placed this on the far left. Play this in the middle. Hmm. I'm scared of like a buy if I play this on the left side. Kinda wanna play Salt Kirk, but I need Salt Kirk. I need Salt Kirk to actually activate, you know, uh, Blue Dream here. So I need, yeah, I need it. I, I mean, yeah, technically I can let Thody just to activate it as well, or maybe this finds a spell. But, eh. Could play Brewer Death Mold on that. I feel honored, truly. 
That's the bio I was afraid of. It's not in a bio. It's a Kara that we can activate. Oh my god, that's so good. So we can salt cut this, right? Or no 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 no, we should nithral this. The problem is death mold might be necessary versus weather because we have no weather clear. But the only weather that's like problematic technically is um frost and frost is less likely than fog in my experience so it's just a lock we can definitely unlock here Bruver has nothing to hit this has nothing to hit that's kind of annoying oh i guess that's a door okay i guess that's an 11 that's fine I might get five damage from sword. Yeah, that's true. We should we should look at that as well. This might still be like DL nine as well, so that's pretty okay. I'm on it. We've got three units damage. So this is a twelve. So I mean, fifteen, I guess. Gas. Uh, I guess I'll just play a uh, Nithril next. Kill the savage bear. Hmm. Yeah, sure, I'll play Nithril now. I could have damaged this as well. Maybe I should have. Maybe I Salt Kirk this. But I should Blue Dream this first. Buff these lads. Oh no, they're a new. Wait, this is fine, actually. Honestly, this is super fine. Cause that's less that's less outrageous, dude. That's less outrageous! <laughs> Wait a second, that's less outrageous. Why am I sad? Those are my points. Exactly. Those are my points. So I can blue dream above these three lads. This is priceless. Then we're looking really solid. Oh no! Try it! He split them up. That's kind of annoying. Nature stinks. No unlock for this, sadly. That's fine. Uh, what do we do with this card? That's quite hmm, intriguing. He shouldn't be killing this. And it's no reason to have done that, but that's fine. I'll play this first. Shall tread on us. What if he's also got Letho Regis? And that's quite scary, because he probably wins. But I'm 9 points ahead right now. Down the card. But we're both getting 2 per turn, so it's not that big a deal. It's quite strong. That is definitely strong. So this is 10 points. Just 10 points on that. Yeah, sure, that works. Instead of 9 points. Somewhat behind right now, but that's that should be okay. Uh, playing that there. Sons of Nilfgaard! 
It's a stern end, so it's okay. So 14 plus 31. Um, I, I think we'll win. Rock slide is pretty good as well, though. Too bad I didn't hit this. Okay, so. Fly here, fly here and here. Damn, damn you, Savage Bear. So he needs 50 points, 60 points or so in two cards. Not sure how he'll do it. Other than with like a Gigni. The only good human is a dead human. That's, that's pretty solid. I know you're in trouble. <laughs> I can <laughs> With my shield or on it! No! No! This hailstorm destroyed me so hard. What do you mean? That hailstorm was so disgusting, not like this. Uh, do we toss this boy? Nah. Is this a rematch? Nice, we finally won coin flip. That is so good for me. Play this now. Now we will see who is weak. Okay. So we don't have Letho right now. Which is annoying. That's quite good. Quite solid. Quite solid. So we can like Immolith Sabath. But I wanna do this because then it buffs at the end of turn. Does he have a way of killing this off? Hopefully not. Kind of has a way of killing it off, fine. Then we can play this in the mid row, which is also fine. Rip your carry over due to a 50-50. Feels okay, man. This could hurt. He's got a way to kill it. Unlucky. Now we could just pass here. That's fair. Or you could play this card. Is there any way this card does anything amazing? I mean, I could play Siri. And if he doesn't play 15 points right now. Or kills this off. I, shall not fail. I gain a card. Unless he's got a way to kill this now, which is fine, but I think I'll still do it. Okay, he's got a shot. He's got a shot at killing it. Don't know how many. I don't know how much removal he's got in his deck, but we'll see. I shall not the Draw a card. Charm doesn't really work. I mean, Charm does work on this. Damage works on this. Fine. But he did sacrifice Shoop for that. So that's quite good. He might have Kahir. That could explain why he went for Kalvit. But this is fine. Now, we don't have a Blue Dream yet. But I'm hoping I'll find one. Uh, tossing this has a chance of breaking. So I will just keep it. And it's not a bad card. A slave driver that's a two is quite strong, honestly. Uh, so I'll just play this. To work! But I think this is fine. Done. So this is obviously not Moren. It could be 11 points. It could be Melane. It could be Teruvial. All of those are potential cards. Um, that's a card I would maybe like to kill. As you wish. There's the Kahir. Kahir is doomed, so no chance of repeating that, but that's okay. I shall not what is the card I'd like to... So do we want to hit this? No, I don't think so. I think Aguara is most likely to be better. And this is most likely Melane or Teruvial. It's very unlikely to be Teruvial, honestly. Uh, so that doesn't do anything. 
Quorn creates a random dwarf, which is okay. It's around 12 points. This is 8 points. So I think, yeah, we go for random dwarf. This is an 11. This is also an 11, but it potentially decreases Melane by uh, quite a bit. By, by 2 points. So this is not Melane, this is Teruvial. Interesting. He actually has Dwarf Synergy. Quite intriguing. And so, I should have probably played this mid row because, you know, Melane is a card that exists, but that's fine. Uh, do we want to hit a Guara to form? I think so. We can Nithril and kill it off. And Clay, and Clay Longship as well. I guess we'll play this first. That This is fine, honestly. Most likely fine, actually. Wouldn't say it's always fine, but it's most likely fine. Maybe I should have played this before I played Sword, but nah, it's all good. That's a Scorch, you say. So currently it's only six here. So I'm just wasn't I'm not sure what I can do with Blue Dream that. Like, I'm not sure how much I can do with this. Hailstorm is okay, it's not amazing. Necromancy is 11 points. Hailstorm is uh, hitting front row, it's about 14, it's fine. Went from 29 to 14, so yeah, quite good. The thing is, it also means Regis is weaker because it's not hitting this boosted unit. Maybe he's got a way, like a 12 boost or something. Oh, that's really good for me. You want to pass, you got to pay. Can't let you through elseways. Is Blue Dreaming Eskal better? Because we can kill Eskal, sacrifice a few points on Saltkirk, sacrificing four points on here to gain a 19 point play instead of a Guara, which is. Hmm. I guess we play this. I guess that's about the best I'll get with Regis. It's 22 po 21 points. It's pretty good. I just have to trade evenly with these two cards. Peter's a good card. Um, so we kill S and then we can S call it an 11. Or we can find a Guara for Scorch, which is not that good. Aguara through form salt kirk is disgusting. Letho is bad. I guess it's not that bad, but it's bad. Uh. Aguara that deals nine is just a worse. Yeah. Just I think we do this. Stand and fight, cowards. No, <laughs> So if we play nine, so if we play twenty points here, it's a draw at best. Wait, I should have considered this most likely. Actually, shit, I should have. Twenty points is a draw. We could just take the draw. Unless this is buffed, but this this is buffed by one. What else has been buffed by one? Was there something else that was buffed by one this game? That he played. I don't remember. This was a 9, right? When he played it. This was a 9. No, this was an 8. Fuck. Might not be a draw. I'll go for the win. Easy win! <laughs> 
is if this is a seven, I would have lost. It's a seven! Oh my god! Oh!